understanding how facet create an audible release. You need a few things. First, you need facet separation to create a noise. Facet separation can be different type. It can be separation this one, or it can be a gapping on the top of the facet, or gapping on the inferior part of the facet. So the first thing that you need is separation of the facet. Then you need co-optation of the facet. What does it mean, co-optation? Basically, you need to have the surface of the top facet being completely in contact with the inferior facet. If we do not have that, basically, we cannot have an audible release. And if I compare it to my hands being facet, if I do, I can create a noise. But now, if I'm just on the sides, I will not be able to create noise. So we need a full co-optation of the facet. Then there is the alignment. If you pull on the head quite strong, quickly, basically you will not get usually an audible release in the lower cervical. Why? Because they are oblique. But you will get a release on the top cervical because basically between the occiput and the atlas, you're almost perpendicular and you can have a traction. Another phenomenon that you, we, we will see that a little later on, it's with the facet, if you do not have relaxation at the level where you, go, you want to have that audible release, relaxation of the ligaments around the articulation, the interspace, nothing will happen because it will be locked and it won't be able to gap or to be separated. And that relaxation is happening just basically when you have a superposition of the facet and also when you have a small segmental extension, especially at the level of the neck, but it happens in all the spine. Segmental extension bring back the top facet from an upslope position to a downslope position with a full coaptation. So in summary, to have an audible release, you need to have first separation of the facet, a coaptation of the facet, a specific alignment of those facets in relation to the thrust, and ultimately what we call segmental, ex segmental extension to create a relaxation of the ligament at the interspace that you want to treat.